Hey guys, welcome back for more Let's Play Resident Evil 2 Remake Part 6, Clear A. Alright, last time we met up with Leon at the gas station and we we made it to the RPD and we met uh, with Elliot and gave us the book for the underground. And we, we battled with Marvin and found three medallions. And after finding all three medallions and meeting Leon... We made it to the underground and met Sherry and fought William Birkin. But now, Chief Irons took Sherry hostage. So we're going to have to find two power panel parts. So we can get the parking garage key. Here we go! Okay. Before I do that, I'm going to go to the shooting range. I forgot about that. This is where I killed those two zombies last time. We'll unlock. Before I pick up these uh, these two items, I'm gonna I'm gonna combine this bejeweled box with no 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 I don't have that yet. But cause it's the ruby is in the item box now, so I'm gonna pick up this roll film. I have to examine it so that it says film third floor locker. This is where I got that one last time. Right now, let's go. Oh, wrong way. I'm gonna put the flashbang grenades in there. I'll get the red jewel out this time. So that I can combine my bejeweled box with Star's badge. I'll examine it. And then we get USB dongle key. For the computer and Star's office, I know. I want to get the high grade gunpowder. So that I can combine it with acid rounds. Cool. Ammo for a grenade launcher. The capsule breaks on impact, soaking the surrounding area with acid. Yeah, my frames are dropping right now. So, yeah. Let's go. I'm gonna go back. I don't have the power panel parts yet. I know how to switch ammo. That's fine. I'm gonna check my item. Yeah. Okay, but seriously. Switch the play rounds and deal with that zombie. More flame rounds. Okay, I'm gonna use the heart key. 
unlock this door. What do we have here? That's one of the electronic parts. I'm gonna have to examine it. Let's open this up and see what we got. Electronic part. This is a power panel part. Okay. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back to the chief's office. And put this power panel part in there. That way I can make more room for my items and stuff. Okay, we'll be back for now, later. Right after I, right after I go for the last power panel part. It's gotta be in the clock tower that this note was talking about. Okay, we're back in the west storage room. We got a big gear. A large gear, that is. And it's that door is locked from the other side. So, we're going outside. Why is it raining? Wow. Ladder doesn't break this time. That's cool. Let's pick up this handgun ammo. Okay, when we go down the stairs, there's a zombie. Female zombie. Oh no. Too bad I don't have that knife. Come on, die. There's another zombie coming from behind me? Now it's in front of me. What the fuck? You can say that again, Claire. Come on. Yeah, that's the way. Now let's go pick up that green herb. Combine that. Booyah! Let's go. Whoa. Too bad, because this door is, at least the club key, is so full of planks and metal pieces. Because that club key is only for Leon, that's for sure. Anyway, I'm going to switch the right side of the lever to the left side. Okay, that's, we're good to go. Go on the stairs. I'm gonna have to push this lever, pull this lever down, and then water comes out of the pipe and puts out the flames of the helicopter. Yeah, yeah, woohoo! Now we can go. Look, a red herb. Like that. Look who's coming. Uh oh. Jesus, stay back. Is that Mr. X? Bitch. Yeah. Okay, Phew. better move it. Yeah, that's right. No matter how many times you you defeat him, he will not die, but he will still be unconscious. Okay, we got the wooden boards that I totally forgot about. Uh-oh. It's alive and kicking this time. Alright. 
Just don't worry about that side. Oh my god, he just broke the window. Okay, we're gonna put this final wooden board in here. Better avoid Mr. X so that he doesn't catch me and kill me. Wow, we're back in the main hall. We're gonna go back to the waiting room so that we can do the combination. I'm gonna go by this again. Let's see here. Left six, right two, left eleven. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, 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 no. Try again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. No, no, no. Try. No, no. Whoops. Booyah! Rocking it! We got high capacity magazine for the JMB HP3. Custom part for the JMB HP3 that extends clip capacity to 26 rounds and shortens reload time. Alright! Find it! Yeah! Okay! This is getting interesting. I need to use this gun. Oh man. Marvin's now zombified. Oh god, no. Marvin. Yeah. I'm sorry. You didn't have a choice, Claire. He was zombified. I mean, if it wasn't for the zombie Brad Vickers, he would not have bitten Marvin. Oh no! The liquors! Not them again! Come on, I'm fighting, man! I seriously hate liquors. You gotta get to the operations room. No, don't worry about those guys coming in. We're going to have to use the heart key for now. Okay. We don't have any use for the heart key no more. So from now on, we're going inside and we're going to pick up this tool. What is this for? That's a mechanic jack handle. All right. Grenade. Nice. Uh oh. A liquor? Oh my god. Ha! Ah. Gotcha, liquor scum. Okay, we're gonna go to the dark room. Let's put this roll film in there. Yep. All right. Let's go. Let's hope Mr. X doesn't pop up and get the daylights out of me.
Oh, before I go over there, I'm gonna go to the linen room. Okay. I think this is the last time we'll be using the diamond key for now. Let's go in. Another gunpowder. And we pick up this portable safe. We're gonna do it again like we did last time. But, but this time it's probably gonna be different. Uh-uh. One, two, six. Oops. Two, six, three. Nope. One, two, six, three. Let's try again. Let's see. One, two, six, three. Seven. Seven, six, eight, four. Yeah! Oh yeah! Now we got a spare key. Okay, I think this is the last spare key we're gonna use. <laughs> is that a zombie? Oh, it's just a corpse. It's unmovable. Alright then, we're gonna put this USB dongle key in the in the computer machine. No. Go on the computer. So that you can unlock the armory door status. There we go! All we got is MQ11! 24 round capacity, 8.380 ACP submachine gun with an extremely high rate of fire. Usually used for spraying an area with bullets. Alright. Oh, this is a letter to Star's member. We read that last time with Leon. This does not sound like Chris. <laughs> I would agree. How does that sound like Chris? All right then. We're gonna go to the weapons, well, to the safe deposit, weapons locker room downstairs. Because this is the last time we'll be going there. Enter. And then we're gonna pick up this hip pouch. That's our fourth hip pouch, folks. All right. Okay. I'm gonna get that knife. Change equipped sub weapon by pressing LB. Use the control pads. I already know that. Now we're gonna go to the library room. Hang on. Let's see here. Oh, okay. Don't have to equip. Alright, that's fine. We're good. Just I was just checking whether my weapons are upgraded or not. Okay. Anyway, we're gonna go to the library. 
by using the mechanic jack handle. Here we are. Let's hope Mr. X doesn't show up. Alright, we already got that handgun ammo last time, but we'll use this mechanic jack handle. The thing just disappeared. Okay, we're gonna push, we're gonna use these bookshelves as a bridge. We'll use it so that we can go. Okay, climb up that ladder. That way you'll be more faster. Alright, we're in the third floor. For now. And there's a zombie. Whoa! Huh. How did you like this taste of grenades? I'll just have to knife them. Oh, good. Okay, we're good to go. Now let's get inside. Got the repair plan. Time to place this large gear. In there, so that it opens up the stairs. I'm gonna pick this large gear up again before we go up there. This thing does. This large gear doesn't fit in there. Let's go inside. We got a gunpowder. Okay, looks cool. Let's go! The large gunpowder is similar to regular gunpowder. Got a small gear. Place this large gear in there. Next, we're going to go down. I'm going to place this small gear up there. Wow. That worked. <laughs> it did work, Claire. The bell just fell down on the ground and and it knocked down a a box. That's another electronic part. Examine this one. Thank you, my mom coffee. She's sick. Got the power panel part, the final one. Okay, we're gonna switch this USB dongle to the stars badge. Yep, that's cool. Probably gonna combine this one for this one. And that too. All right, really good to go, folks. Now it's time to go back to Chief Irons' office. A zombie? Do I hear menacing footsteps? No! Stay down. It's 
Mr. X again! Get the heck away from me, you sadist! You just scared the living crap out of me, man. Oh my god, go away. Go away! Ah! Ah, ah, ah! Run! Oh, thank god I'm safe now. Alright. I'm gonna get some more submachine gun ammo. I'm gonna put the starts back in there. Why did, how did Mr. X get in there? He's creepy. Oh, wow. So where are we again? The private collection room. We're heading back in there. So that we can put this power panel there and we gotta do our puzzle. It's gonna be a major pain in the butt to do it. Disastrous. Nope. Oh, great. We need two more. Let's see where you go. This puzzle's a pain in the butt. Aha! worked. Now let's go inside. But before we go inside, I'm going to check for some more items. Nope. All good. Now let's go inside. A phone call. Who could it be? Chief Irons. Again. Where's that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. Okay, folks. We're gonna play as this this young lady named Sherry. We have to escape from Chief Irons. We're gonna pick up this stuffed doll. A dirty stuffed doll. Examine this one. And we have to run zip that thing so that it could give you a block weathered looking old block and that that's a picture block a weathered looking old block it's got some raised images on it all right this puzzle is going to be a major pain in the butt Don't get so confused. Okay. Wrong. Wrong block. Star. Man, oh man, oh man. This is going to be annoying. Nope. Gotta make sure that the bottom, the middle, and the top match.
on, stop moving around. Man, this is kind of confusing. What's the point? Trying. Seriously. Yes. There we go. Okay. Middle, circle, square, star, square, star. And the top one, square, triangle, circle, star, and triangle. And then we get a pink scissors. A pair of children's scissors. All right. We're going to cut this tape down with our scissors so that it will reveal passage. We're going to press the left trigger to crouch. What is this? This is the security room to the bedroom. Why are there so many drawings? Did you just draw a blue, a blue, a white polka dotted hippo? Sunflower says, welcome, hello, and then he sun, three flower, four flowers, two fishes, the bee, children's room, blue and red mushrooms, and then he drew a sun, at least that's not the angry sun from Super Mario Bros. 3. <laughs> that's the nursery room. He's drawing a, they drew a, a cat and a purple giraffe. Let's read this one. Sally's Diary, January 4. Wednesdays are perfectly great days because we get snacks and ice cream. I hate the last place I was at. The teachers were all meanies. It was just steady, 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 and there was no ice cream. I love, love, love it here. January 10, there was an important rule made today. Everybody must write a diary, get health checkups, and we ain't allowed outside by ourselves. It's good we don't have to go to school. I don't want to go get, get picked on for my old clothes, especially not by the guy that used to wear them. January 16th. Oh, wow. Is that a plane outside I heard? Where was I? Oh, yeah. The orphanage director is coming today, so I'm going to wear my most favorite checkered blue outfit. The director is tall. The director has a mustache. The director is a policeman. It must be Chief Irons, right? We drew a hopscotch. A penguin shaped, a bowling, a bowling pin shaped penguin, and they got a, another bee. Wow. And rainbow. It says rainbow and fish. It says here, danger, no climbing. Don't run. We're going to have to pull the A button to push this drawer open this drawer. What's, this, what's they got in there? Books and lids. <laughs> Gonna go on the top. Go through the window. The opened window. <laughs> wow. It's a lot of birthday streamers. We got coffee mugs and... Is that milk in the microwave and... Is that bleach? And they got baby cribs. Teddy bear. Right. The door to the... I don't know. What does this lead to? Okay. We're going to crouch. Is that a bunny? A pink bunny? And, and a teddy bear? That had no ears on it? We got baby blocks, dice, a globe, a lot of kitty drawings. 
right? We're heading to the front, to the front of the orphanage. That must be the door out of here. I can tell. Oh look, is that the jester from Devil May Cry again? No, that's not him. <laughs> Yeah, you need the key, Sherry. Oh, look, an alligator. And is that Godzilla? Let's take a look at this. Tom's Diary, February 5. It's been month. It's been two months since I sent that letter to Oliver, and I've gotten back his nada, zip, that again, they're all like that once they get adopted. That he's living like a king in some fancy folks' home and forgotten all about us. Willie thought Oliver was different, that he'd be my friend for life. Guess I'm just a fool. February 8. Anne sat all the little kids down and told them a story today. She said all the kids that get adopted are turned into food for the boogeyman. That's why no one hears from them ever again. Not sure where he gets her ideas from, but she sure got the mind for writing trashy horror novels. February 13th. There's something weird going around here, and it's not just because of Anne's story. Don't get me wrong, I've been in worse places, and this place is funded by some big drug company. But why can't we call people or go outside? Why are there so many doctors around? What's with those shots every day? It's almost like we're February 14th. I'm getting adopted. Me. Most people go out for younger kids, so I figured I was too old. But I can't say I'm not a little happy. Who am I kidding? I'm totally psyched. I say goodbye to this place on the 20th. I'm going to try my best to be a good son. Someone my new mom and pop can be proud of. February 19th. Oliver came back in the middle of the night, all messed up, screaming, Help me and stuff. I didn't even recognize him at first. His face was all peeling and melted off. He's with the teachers and doctors now. It's just a skin thing, they say. He'll better be. He'll get better soon, and then we can go on adventures together again. Wow. Why are they doing arts and craft? Seriously, are they drawing fruits for math? What the world? Okay, we're gonna go to that hallway. Leading to the director's office. Oh no, it's him. I see the shadowy figure of Chief Irons. Okay, we're in the director's office. And there's a typewriter. We're gonna read. Whose diary is this? I don't know. If you're reading this, go call police. Boogeyman's here, eating everybody. Many bark boogeyman's here. Help! They're coming! Help me, mommy! Wow. That's weird. Anyway, let's look over there. Who is that girl? Is that the mayor's daughter? Did Chief Irons taxidermy her? He killed her! Oh my god. And why is she so pale? I have no idea. But anyway. Look, there's an umbrella. There's a curtains over there. Go over there, you will be automatically caught. But let's pick up the key anyway. Where you going, Sherry? I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Oh, it's gotta hurt. You little bitch. You're gonna pay for this. Looks like Two Face. Oh, shit. Uh oh, the Chief's furious. Run, Sherry. You are gonna be so fucking sorry. You're the one who's gonna be sorry, Chief. We're gonna run away from him. Help! Somebody, please! You stupid bitch! That's a dead end. <laughs> it's just a. That's a dead end. Okay, guys, we're gonna run away from Chief Irons. And we threw that acid on his face. He's now furious. Now, doors locked. 
my god. We're trapped. If Chief Irons catches me with a flashlight, Where he's gonna you? he's gonna run and chase Show me. Yourself. And if I, I get caught, you're in here. you fail. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. He's an angry jerk. I hate Chief Irons. Pushing the crib? Oh god. Oh god. Uh-oh. Get caught and you fail, Sherry. Just gotta be here somewhere. I know. God damn it. <laughs> well, I'm gonna catch me. See you. You have got to be kidding me. No! Game over, Sherry. Uh, no! I failed. I just messed it up. Did you see what Chief Irons just said? Game over, Sherry. He just broke the fourth wall. <laughs> Let's try again. Don't get caught in the flashlight beam or you'll be spotted. We'll have to do this again. I'm really annoyed right now. It's all over now. Doors locked. Let's try again. Where are you? Show yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's going to be. <laughs> the, the longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's going to be. What a cranky chief. <clears throat> All right. Now this time... Oh, God. Oh, God. When he's... When he's limping in pain. That bitch has got to be here somewhere. I'll go over there. Oh, oh. God damn it. Yep. He's upset. We're going to hide under the table, folks. Hey, look. It's Pinocchio. At least I made it. Hmm. <clears throat> <laughs> Please. This is your last fucking chance. Show yourself. Now! <laughs> Show yourself. Now! Uh oh. oh. It burns! You deserve it. Is he in the restroom washing his face? Yep. Okay, while he's washing his face, you gotta pick up the key before he gets out. Orphanage key. A key to the door of the orphanage. Booyah! You gotta run away from him from now on. Where the fuck is my key? Uh oh. I see, I see you. you. And he turns the lights on and catches you? Then he's enraged. Run as fast as you hurry, can, Sherry. Hurry, hurry. Okay. We're about to make it. Let's use the orphanage key second time. Huh? Oh, no, he changed the nice try, Sherry. He changed the main door? He chained it? What in the world? We're gonna use that orphanage key one more time. So I'm coming to you, Sherry! Oh my god! What a ripoff of the shiny! Run! Made it! Good game. 
is over. No! <laughs> now you're in trouble. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. oh, stop. Ew. What the heck? He just put a a G embryo inside of Chief Irons. That worm thing. That's really messed up. Seriously. Thirty minutes earlier. Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time. Bring me the pendant, or Sherry dies. The pendant. What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage. Where is that? In the neighborhood, you'll find it. Is Sherry all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Hung up. Are you serious? Damn it. Got the parking garage key card. Yeah. Just you wait, asshole. We're going to rescue Sherry from the orphanage. See what Chief Irons just did when when he caught Sherry? He said the game is over. He just broke the fourth wall a second time. <laughs> Until William Birkin had to plant that G embryo egg onto on a Chief Irons mouth. Sherry had to run away from him and her father. All right, folks. Gotta give the pendant to Chief Irons in the orphanage. But. We're gonna go down the elevator. Because this is the last time we've been going to Chief Irons' office. No acid rounds. Okay, we're gonna have to put our parking garage key card inside. You again? Oh no, not Mr. X again. Guess I'll have to hold him, hold him off. Okay, he's stunned for now. Pick up the green herb. You gotta run away from him before he gets me. Drop the machine gun. Too bad, gun shop Kendo's closed. But only Leon can go there. Watch out, the zombie busted down the chain door. <laughs> Why do you ask what, ask what is up with these zombies? They're killing them. Come on, die. Okay. We're good now. Let's go. Growing up. Looks like the only way forward. Yeah. I know. Can you imagine Claire catching a cold if he stays in the rain for too long? He might get a she might get a virus and turn into a zombie. But I digress. Let's check out these zombie dogs first. Come on. There's a zombie lady over there. Once you head down the stairs. Finish her off. Oh, 
<laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> she just said F you to this lobby. <laughs> Have to deal with these zombie dogs. All right, we're in the street. Zombie's gonna go on top of the white car. Man, are these zombie dogs this annoying? Seriously. All right. Well, that's a corpse. At least that's not a zombie. Probably need to check. No items there. Fine with me. Because we're going, we're on the basketball court. Oh, shit. Kill those zombie the dog bozos over there. Okay, we're gonna pick up the green herb and the submachine gun around the two benches. Oh, I have to combine the herbs. Deal with that zombie dog. Booyah. Let's go. I'm going that bus. We got a grenade. With him. Zombie dog. He's over there. I'll show you. That's got to be the orphanage. True. Wow, I made it. I made it out alive. Hang on, Sherry. All right. So that's where their orphanage is. Where Chief Irons took Sherry. I mean, Chief Irons killed three people? And, and they wire their grave tombstones in front of the orphanage. He just buried them and killed them? What the world? Let's go inside. Yeah, I agree with Sherry that you have that she has the pendant. Let's go in there. Sherry, Sherry, are you here? Where is Sherry? Okay, we're in the nursery room. We're heading into the bathroom. This is the part where Chief Irons washed his face because Sherry threw that hydro hydrofluoric acid onto it. To the right side of his face or the left side. This is a reference to Two Face from Batman, but I digress. Anyway, let's read this. Letter from the director. Regarding the incident in question, I'm glad to report that it, it has been taken care of, all been taken care of. On February 19th, Test Subject 628 escaped from the lab and broke into our facility. 628 was originally from the facility's candidate pool and apparently returned in the hope of seeking help. 628 was quickly detained by our staff. As 628 was undergoing one of the lab's clinical trials, there was, a, there was the distinct possibility that he had brought the virus with him, so we disposed of all our test subjects' candidates as a precaution. Their speedy disposal was conducted by the security team, to whom I like to extend my thanks. As for our neighbors, we told them that due to the building's dilapidated state, we have temporarily moved all of the children to a different orphanage for their safety. As to the future of this facility, once it has been fully de decontaminated, I plan to resume securing more test candidates. Alright. Submission gun ammo! 
All right. Okay, we're gonna go back downstairs. Head to the director's room, which, in other words, he broke the door with an axe. Well, it's not fully broken. So let's go. Ah. Your fault. What? It took too long. What happened? Oh, God. Get, get off me. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ugh. What it just happened? That G parasite just, just just jumped out, just bursted Chief Iron's chest. This is a ripoff of Aliens. I mean, I mean in the in the original Resident Evil, that on Claire A, it, that G parasite just jumped out of Chief Iron's chest. But on Claire B, he got ripped in half by William. What in the world? All right, we're in the director's office. Hey, what in the world? Who trashed this place? Did William do this? I don't know. And there's a owl statue and collections of butterflies and beetles. A lot of insects. And they got an armadillo, fox, and a raccoon on the shelf. Why is the experiment table dropped and the mayor's dead daughter still there? And why are all the chemical fluids all over the ground? That's a pigsty, wouldn't you say, guys? <laughs> okay, we're heading to the secret passage so that we can find Sherry. There you are, Sherry. I'm glad you survived. Well, let's go. Is your ex again? Go, go, go! We gotta run away from him. Clear! It's behind you! Don't stop! He can't stop, because if you stop, he's gonna slug you in the face, Claire. Keep going. Made it! Sherry, come on! Oh my god! Daddy? What'd you say? Is it that, Sherry? It go two heads? Oh! He's bone. Daddy, no! just killed Mr. X? Seriously? Claire, are you all right? Can you hear me? Claire? Claire, you have to get up. He's going to get us. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up. Wake up. Annette! Open your eyes. Hold still. Not infected. Sherry? Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? It's an impressive display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. Where is she? Hello? What? Where oh, she? Annette. Tell me, 
What happened to William? I don't know. Who's, who is that? The creature responsible for this. What? Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. <laughs> Everything's under control. I need to find Sherry. My daughter is not your concern. I'm gonna find Sherry. Where did Sherry go? I don't know where she go. Let's see what happened. Annette just came just in time to wake me up. But I'm glad I made it made it from the crash. The elevator Sherry's crash. Her daughter? Yes. Sherry's Annette's daughter, Claire. Okay, let's go inside. This is the save room. We're going to pick up this uh, report about G. The G virus clinical trial will be entering its final phase very soon. Before G, the new creature that will surpass humans, is born. Allow me to predict a few things about its biology and biological functions. Intelligence. The subject's intelligence will begin to drop immediately with their linguistic abilities disappearing within a matter of days. Finally, they will lose their capacity to reason in their humanity. G will be a creature of pure instinct, driven only by a need to survive and reproduce physical abilities. Due to its unusually accelerated cell division evolution, it will be highly adaptable to any environment. Furthermore, with its amazing ability to repair itself through regeneration, it will be extremely difficult to completely kill it with any conventional small firepower. Reproductive behavior. G's most remarkable feature will be its intense desire to reproduce. It will distinctively search out humans with DNA that closest matches its own and implant an embryo in them. But the chances of success are very low, and if the DNA is not a close enough of a match, an underdeveloped G creature will be reproduced will be produced instead. I suppose the only ones who might be a close enough of a match would be any biological children of the subject, though. Wow. Anyway, we got more... We got high power rounds for the SLS 60. High power rounds for the SLS 60, now with more gunpowder goodness. To punch these deliver require a stronger gun for him to fire. Cool. We'll have to save those for a tough boss battle. Door is locked. What does it lead to? I don't know. Probably in Annette's office. Anyway. We're gonna go down. Let's take a look over there. Nothing interesting. But anyway, Sherry, let's carry on. Can you hear me? Oh wow, sewer water again. Now I'm gonna smell like shit. Literally. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Anyway, we're still walking around in the sewer water. So nasty. Same thing that Leon did. That high grade gunpowder. Gotta get two of these so that we can get more submachine gunning. Right up there. Yeah, I agree, Claire. It is a cable car. That leads to the nest. Climbing up. We're in the control room, full of annoying zombies. Shit! Take that. Zombie? Why in the world does a zombie play possum? That's about a break. I just broke. Watch 
finish them off there. You already did finish them off, so that's that's good. Oh look, flame rounds. Only one? Seriously? Yeah, I know that. Oh, we're gonna do this com combination like last time. S Z F. Easy. More of those. That's totally nice. Good. It's all blue. All good. Now we can go. Sherry? Why didn't you stay in the house? It was safe there. Hey, Sherry! Uh, I was scared. Those things were everywhere, and... You should have called the police. That's what we taught you. Uh, I did, but nobody came, and you didn't answer your phone, so... Sherry, uh, I don't have time for this. Uh... uh, 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 uh Oh no. Sherry! Sherry, I'm coming! Hold on, Sherry. I'll be right there. Oh, we're gonna save Sherry. Is she getting infected? Oh my god. Now we got a sewers map. Okay, we're gonna pick up this handgun ammo. Alright. Probably you need to put those mixed herbs in there. All the herbs. There we go. What do we got here? Electronic part. This is a night plug. Place this one in there correctly. We're gonna find the plugs. It's the bishop. All right. Let's read this one. Rook and knight are on the same wall. The bishop and the queen are next to each other. The queen and rook were opposite each other too. The rook has got to be right there somehow. The queen. I can't tell, but let's take a look at this. It's a pawn. I'm going to put this back for now. More matches. We're pulling down that lever. Once we pull the lever, the bridge lowers it. All right. Let's go over there to the cable car. Let's pick up that tool. This is a T-bar valve handle. Right. Let's read this. This is a delivery receipt. The heat resistance safe. No, I don't have a knife anymore. We're gonna have to go to where the safe is. Let's read this one. Left two, right twelve, left eight. Here we go. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two. Three. And we got reinforced frame for the SLS 60. Reinforced custom part for the SLS 60. 
Made of stainless steel, this frame allows the gun to fire special high-powered high rounds. Cool. Let's do it. Let's test it out. It has a, a, a plus symbol on the bullet. Perfect headshot. Switch to this one. Pick up this blue herb. I'm going to get the red herb. Stairs. Oh, headshot. Very lucky. Okay. I'm going to use my submachine gun. that for now. Before we go, I'm going to pick up a grenade. Awesome. Now let's pull down that lever. Wait for it to fully open. All right, now go. What the heck? Oh, we got a a G. This guy's gonna be. Watch out for those those G embryo babies. And he spits out of his mouth. You're poisoned. These guys are friggin' poisonous. Okay, I don't want to waste the bullets. Alright, we'll use the T bar valve handle right now. Before we go on. Yeah. No, no, no. We're gonna go inside of this area where we can find high power rounds. Lift. Let's switch to this one and kill off that zombie. Now I got a roll film. What does that say? This is a hiding place. Uh, we got our fifth hip pouch. Booyah! Gonna unlock this door. Oh my god, I missed! Take that. Now, going down the stairs. We'll pick up the USS digital video cassette.
God. Get away from me, you scum. Come on. Get away. Who's a dog? God, he just ambushed me. He just played possum on me. Ow. Got slammed in the face. Don't you like it if I slammed your face, huh? the way down, that's for sure. Okay, pick up this key. Sewer's key. Go down the ladder. Okay, this place is creepy. Take that, you freak. For me. Oh, those things. Those things they shoot out. They look disgusting. That's another G embryo? That's like a bomb? Don't let it poison you, Claire. You see that zombie? That G. That G adult coming out of the big pipe? Taste of fire and bullets, punk. Why are there so many disgusting infected body parts there? Ugh. Now we're going in there. And there's a Mr. Raccoon. Shit. Nope. Try again. Yeah. Let's see what this thumb. 
Give him a good headshot. The red herb. We're in the storage room. Got Queen's plug. Put this queen plug in there. Opens up. Next. Go to the second floor and pick up that uh, king's plug. Go down. Come on! plug here got this spark shot this gun fires wired metal prongs into your target allowing you to fry with electricity for as long as you have the weapon raised or holding left trigger and continue to stay focused on your target however if you let this, this gun send too much power over the wire the wires will snap after one final surge spark shot high voltage gun for use on test animals charging takes a while and the needles wires snap easily but it also really packs a punch. Cool. I'm gonna lock that door. All right. Let's pick up this plug. And clean plug. Clean plug in here. Plug. King plug, that is. Go in there and pick up that pick up the king. Go back and whoa. Get the king. Yes! There we go. We're getting out of the storage room. Yeah. Uh, Still with that monster over there. Did he rams into you? And he poisons you by vomiting on you. It's gonna be very annoying. By the way, what's your spark shot? I've never been poisoned before. You're coughing. All I'm gonna have to do is use the blue herbs. Much better. You can see Claire coughing. Hold still for maximum discharge. Come on, finish him off. Yeah. What you get for poisoning me, you scum? Oh, wow. Can't believe it. I can't believe he poisoned me for no reason. Using the two bar valve handle. Or we. Going up. My game is lagging like crazy. What the heck? I'm gonna put this video cassette on the t on that VCR. Let's watch it.
that <laughs> right, I'm gonna get rid of this video cassette for now I'm gonna put the king and queen here no, 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 no. These, those gene monsters are very poisonous. Why do they, why do they puke on victims? The vomit is very poisonous. You can't do anything when you're poisoned. All you gotta do is use those blue orbs to cure poison. Remember those enemies that cause poison? They include the spiders. There weren't any spiders in this one, but I'm glad there isn't. But before we pick up this rook plug, we're gonna go into the treatment facility with this sewers key. And there. there were spiders in Resident Evil 1, 2, 3, and Code Veronica, and 0. Wow. Now we got Gunpowder Large. So we can get some acid rounds. Okay, now let's pick up this drive part, which is a rook plug. Okay. Oh, let's get rid of that. We got more drum powder, more acid rounds. All right, let me pick up this raccoon adjustable flyer. Some more handgun. We're gonna push this. We're gonna put this two lockers to reveal a secret passage. Where does this lead to? This leads to the underground where I fought William last time. All right. That's the door that leads from the other side. All I'm going to need is the badge. Make sure I make more room for my items and stuff. Okay. I'm gonna get the stars badge from now on. No, no, no. Just combine. I'm putting the first aid spray inside the box. Alright. We're gonna use this T bar valve handle one last time. We're heading back to the RPD main hall. Cool. Oh wow. Why is this stuff, why is this main door full of stuff here? Who puts that there? I think it's probably Chief Irons or William. Let's 
testing all that zombie. Ha! Ah, got cooked. Oh, another one. Oh wow, he's still alive. That does it. You're finished. Oh my god! That's how I deal with you, loser zombies. You know what? I don't have time to mess with you. Run into the dark room. Third time this time. Hiding place. The star's office in the press room. Oh, man. oh. That's where I'm gonna get that submachine gun ammo. After finding the third floor locker code ECM. Alright. Finally got it. Probably gonna find more ammo. So I could be prepared for the final boss. This. So there would be a wooden box, but not just a wooden box, a roll film. Let's take a look at this. Rising rookie. Open up this wooden box to give you high capacity mag magazine. Custom part for the MQ11 that extends clip capacity to 50 rounds. Combine this one. Can I no, 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 no. This is the. That's the one. There we go. All right, let's go. Might as well find more high-grade gunpowder. Shoot spray. Probably need to check my map. Still more. More items there, still. Nothing in there of the sort. Stick around one more time. All we got is flashbang grenades. Hold up. I don't need the red herbs. Well, I'm gonna get some flashbang grenades just in case. All right, we're good. We're good for now. Actually, don't need the red herb right now. Okay, we're gonna go to the dark room one more time. 
This is a picture of Rebecca Chambers. Again. Yeah, she's pretty. Okay. I'll put in the first aid spray here. In there. Records room. Where the gun power is. I don't need it right now, so let's just go. I'm gonna go back in there and find more gunpowder. The white gun powder. Perfect. Let's see here. Put another one. Oh, right. I gotta go. Yeah. Whoa, did my game just lag on me? My frame dropped? Is that a zombie? Oh my god, hang on. You can't combine them because you can only carry 10 of these rounds. Open this drawer. You're gonna pick up the needle cartridges. Ammo for the spark shot. These highly charged electric cartridges would deliver more than just a few pins and needles to your target. All right. We're gonna head back underground, folks. check. We still have the star's badge, so that's good. Good thing I have to make room for that. By combining these other submachine gun to the, to the highest one. Alright. Just stop lagging. Inside. Yay. Now we got suppressor. Custom part for the MQ11 that suppresses the sound of gunfire and acts as a counterweight to greatly reduce muzzle rises. It carries two slots. Okay, this is the last time we're going to use the Star's Badge. We're going back.
Oh, okay. The treatment for facilities. This is the area where I went and got the sewer ski last time. But it went this time. Place the rock plug in there. Final one. So that it opens the door to where right, Sherry is. Sherry. On my way. I'm gonna save, save Sherry again. I got blue herb. Well. Take a look. Power must be out. Yep. Clean the power room. Put the red alert. Alright, I'm gonna do this. One. One. Two. Okay, the power's on. Looks clear. Let's go. Oh crap! Shit! Oh man, fire! Avoid those claws. Oh my god! When you see rubble coming out, do avoid those. Do avoid the claws. doing there's another fire oh my god how many times are you gonna keep clawing me oh good lord not warning again I'm getting burned here yeah she's clawed me in the face Clawing me, jerk! Should have known you wouldn't die. Yeah, gotta run away from William right now. And there's a big crane. No matter how many times you hit him, you can't kill him. Now we got a combat knife and flash grenades. Battle's really annoying, guys. I don't like it. Come on, hurry up. I'm in danger! And I'm about to die. Okay. You gotta make sure to hit William with that crane. Could you stop that, please? You're tanning on my last freaking nerves, bud. Come on. You wanna do your little tactic, buddy? Yeah, it's still slow to reload. Come on. Yes, that's my chance. Yeah, clear gets hit instant death. Oh. Yeah, try again. 
couldn't do it like we did last time. That hurt! Now you're starting to get on my last nerve, William. Do it. Call me a little more time or I'm gonna get mad. Okay, now I'm mad. Alright. This is hard to avoid. Are you serious? He's supposed to stand in front of that crane. Come on now. Stand up so I can beat you. That freaking hurt. What? All right, one more time. All right, time for an encore. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Bam. Take that, William, you big punk. I'm so sorry, Sherry. This is taking forever. Yeah. All right. William's defeated this time. We'll lock this door. And pull the lever down. Sherry? Claire? Sherry, are you all right? What are you doing? I'm here to help. Sherry's been implanted. She can't be saved. Are you fucking kidding me? You're her mother. Get in here! You don't understand. <laughs> is over. Wait. Wait. I, I can treat her. In my lab. It's not far away. Mommy? There's not enough time. Millions of lives are at stake. Sherry. Mommy loves you, sweetie. Bye. Are you fucking kidding me? Sherry, don't worry. I will get you whatever you need, okay? Well, why are you doing this? Because I care. Thank you, Claire. I'm going to the lab. See what happened to Sherry? She got implanted with the G virus. We're gonna head to the cable car. That said her lab's not far. Wait, that cable car. Yep. We're taking Sherry to the cable car, folks. Hold on, Sherry. You're gonna be fine. See what Claire just did? She just shouted to it in Annette, get over almost here. There, <laughs> We're almost there. Kind of funny. Alright. We're almost there. Good. The cable car. Good thing she has the wristband. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Just hold on, Sherry, okay? 
We're gonna be just fine. Oh my God, right eyes yellow. It's got veins on her face. Okay, we better check everything. There's no turning back. Yeah, we won't be going back once we head to the nest. This will be the last time we're going to this. This tram is bound for nest. Do not exit until the final destination. Why is Claire's jacket on Sherry? fine without me until I came along and got you all sorts of trouble. I have something of yours. I don't want it. Really? Why not? It's so pretty. It's from my mom. For my birthday last year. All I really wanted was for her to be home more. I know it seems like your mom doesn't care, but uh, hey, uh, Sherry, come uh, here. Uh, uh, hey, hang in there, okay? Now arriving at nest. Uh, it's okay. I've got you. Come on. Wow. See what what Sherry just said? Your jacket is so warm. <laughs> it made me really laugh so hard. I'm getting you treatment. Just hold on, Sherry. It's okay. Oh wow, we're gonna be carrying Sherry again. My goodness, Claire looks so hot without the jacket. Stand clear until the doors are fully open. I love this. Stand clear until the doors are fully open. For your safety, stand clear until the doors are fully open. Welcome to your nest. Yeah. Enjoy your visit. We're investigating the lab right now. But for now, we can't pick up anything until we take Sherry to safety. <sighs> okay. Um... Now what? Um, huh. There's got to be something here. Antiviral agent. That's it. That's got to be it. Hmm. Hey. Hey, Sherry. I got to go. You stay right here, though, okay? I'll be back soon. I promise. Guy ID wristband. Take a good look at this. It's for visitors. She has visitors? Seriously? Let's read this one. Important nest wide alert. Due to an incident in the north area, all nest personnel are to immediately use the devil antiviral agent on themselves. Devil is the only way to prevent G mutation. If you have been infected with the G virus, seek help immediately to target and destroy the G cells in your body. This email is automatically generated in the event of an emergency. Please do not reply to this message. Alright. Why in the world is a, a button shirt there? Okay, you got some flame rounds. Too bad. Inventory's full. Got search lab. Yeah, let's talk to Sherry. 
There's nothing you can do about it right now, so I'm gonna have to make room. But before we before we go find the antiviral stuff for Sherry, I'm gonna end this stream for now. Alright everybody, that's it. That's it for part six of Let's Play Resident Evil 2 Remake. Uh, Claire A, I will see you in in part seven. See you then. <laughs>